we've got basketball action at the AT&T Center. We're in San Antonio, Texas, the home of the Spurs, live on 2K Sports. Just a single game here at home. After this one, it's back on the road for the Spurs. Everyone on this team is pleased with the beginning of the season. They're playing so well right now. Five consecutive wins. And you know, right now for San Antonio, the step forward they've taken this season has been a giant one. I, I thought they'd be an improved team, but I had no idea they could be this good. It really has been something to see. I mean, a remarkable and quick turnaround. It's been dramatic in how far they've come from last season. And just under two and a half minutes elapsed here in the first. That's good. I like the fact that he led his teammate right to the out. Hornets trail by three. Here's Captain Clutch. He nails it. And we're tied up. And how about that exhale? Big pace putting a lot of pressure on the ball handlers and forcing turnovers. Another big aspect of their game tonight has been the fast break transition opportunity. They're really keeping it up tempo so far. And he just leaves the table is just professionalism, leadership, and a real example of how to get the most out of what you've got. He keeps everybody on the team focused, too. When he speaks, the seven shooting the ball here in the second quarter. There's Captain Clutch. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Captain Clutch has got his an example of a different mindset between these teams. That one's good. The San Antonio lead has got down to 11 on the bucket from Captain Clutch. Yeah, right now, with this team leading, perhaps, you know, let's focus on some other areas of the game. Oh. Here's Captain Clutch. It's good from long range. Captain Clutch has got nine points in the quarter. Screen by Jefferson. Five to shoot. Captain Clutch. And that one goes in as he is fouled. It'll be three points if he converts at the line. Both teams making substitutions here. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. And Parker, here we go. And so that's the end of the first half. It's the Spurs up by 12. And a chance now to send you over to Doris Burks. Welcome back, everybody. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Ernie Johnson along with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. Kawhi Leonard is having one of those nights. He had 21 points, two steals, and one rebound. It's a great bounce-back game for him. Not happy with his performance in their last outing. Tonight, he's taking charge. And Shaq, what are your thoughts on how San Antonio played? Well, what's really shifted the game in their favor has been their rebounding. They got a good edge on the board, and that's a product of their hard work. All five guys have been battling, putting everything they have to fight on the glass. That needs to remain the focus for two more quarters if they want to hang on to that lead. Looking at Charlotte, Kenny, your thoughts? Well, they're facing a very hot team in the first half. I mean, guys are shooting the ball lights out. But you have to do more to get stops. I mean, tough defense is the key. And if you put pressure on the ball and more bodying up down low, that's going to establish more aggressive tone that might shut them down in the second half. And that's it for halftime as the second half is just about to get underway. See you after the game. That analytic in an abbreviated fashion, E field goal percentage is a pretty good <laughs> indicator of how good your offense is. To the paint. That is good, and the Spurs lead has cut down to just eight points with the buck. Pass to Captain Clutch. Jefferson, a screen on green. Here's Captain Clutch. Plays it up and in on the nice reverse. Captain Clutch has got 19 points. Six to shoot. And he makes no mistake on the slam dunk. My goodness, he sure can get off the ground. Mm, oh. One of the best in the business for sure. You're I right. I tell you what, he is an imposing to the NBA level yet. But I think if he can improve his motor, he's going to have an opportunity to be an impact player for a long time. No clue how he got that one to fall. And that was not a soft foul he had to get through, Greg. I mean, 
He had to really power that one up and in. And you know, regarding Lamb's development, most scouts felt the weaknesses he did have could be ironed out over time. Well, there's still time. He needs to improve his strength, his ball handling, and his One effort shot. on defense. All things well within his control. One shot. And watching Al Jeff. Here's the three. That's good. 22 points for Captain Clutch. And that the first year he laced up his sneakers, he increased the tempo for that entire Spurs offense, and it continues to this team. Cloak loose. And a fast break now for the Hornets. And he goes up strong with one hand and flushes it down. There's the triple. That's good. Captain Clutch has got 15 points here in the second half. And Elijah won. Well, guys, this was never really a contest. Just a total obliteration, if you will. And you can safely say mission of open looks, and it also helped to get uh, you know, more guys involved in the offense easy. They made the defense adjust by moving the ball like that, and there was no answer for it. And so with this win, they'll move to six victories on the season. And with the win approaching, they'll take the and set the tone. It sure is. It's just the two gamers since they're in opposite conferences, and you can oh. <laughs> and that's the classic one-two punch right there. I mean, much beyond the arc, and the shot is good. Captain Clutch has got 38 points. For the three, that's good. Captain Clutch has got 41. Ginobili dishes the mill. And so it's San Antonio easily taking this one. A confident win and one where they clearly showed the greater effort. They certainly put on a good show here at home, and I think they felt they had the edge and that extra little bit of confidence. And now we'll send it down to Doris Burke, who's standing by courtside. And that'll do it for tonight for Kenny Smith, Shaquille O'Neal, Kevin Harlan, and our illustrious 2K Sports crew. This is Ernie Johnson. Have a good night, everybody.